Hey, it's your boy Sean, and this is The Limit. And on today's episode, we have a very special episode. It's something I wasn't really prepared to talk about. Ferrari has unveiled a brand new special car. The Ferrari P80C, which is a special uh, customer build car. Now, as you know with these Ferrari one-offs, you have to be somebody who is very knowledgeable about Ferraris and uh, I want to say a top-tier customer, somebody who's bought in almost every Ferrari and to get to build your own. Now, this car is different from the other one-offs. There was I just did a video about the SP30 and this car is something totally different. This unlike the others was based on a race car. That's right. This is based on the Ferrari 488 GT3. Now, I can't break down the in and outs of this car because I don't know much about it and you really don't come here to see that from me there are other youtubers other car enthusiasts other professionals who can talk more in depth about this stuff but what you realize about this car that is not particularly street legal and i wouldn't expect it to be seeing that it's been based off a race car there's no headlights whatsoever and the interior is also based off of that gt3 race car and this car was inspired by the 206 Dino and the 330 P3 P4 race car from back in the 60s. So it's got that racing heritage in its design and in its build. And this car also isn't held back by homologation. While the GT3 was limited to 592 horsepower, this car won't have such a limit. Now, there's no telling how much power there actually is in this car. It could be 700, it could be less. I don't know, and I can't speculate. This Ferrari also has removable body panels, which gives it easier access for mechanics and people working on the car. That way, you know, in case something happens, you don't have to tear the car completely down. It's all removable, it's all detachable, and the car also has removable big wang, you know, for the people or for the owner to be able to show off the differences if you want to bring on shows and things of like that nature. He asks for that specific detail or um design so he can be able to take the wing off or put it on whenever he wants to whether he's racing it or whether he's showing the car off he also has street tires he can put on this car which is different from the more grippy racing tires i don't know why i don't know how he even thinks he can drive this on the road without all the crash proof and and safety features and no headlights or i assume no rear lights just reversing lights on the car he can only drive it during the day so don't expect to see this at night or don't even expect to see it at all because it is after all a one-off track focused tire slaying beast an animal and i'm really excited to actually have caught this news on the day that it was announced or maybe two days after but i'm able to actually put a video out for you guys to consume it to bring it in to enjoy it and i really do enjoy doing videos like this but i also have to get to the other videos i want to put out there for you guys now before i end this very short video what are your guys thoughts on this new special one-off ferrari and do you think we'll see a hypercar version of the one-off special that Ferrari has done. I don't know if that's gonna be the case. Those cars cost millions of dollars, but there's no telling how much these race cars cost to you know, do that special design and all that stuff. There's no telling how much this car itself costs. And 
I'm starting to think we might get a yearly announcement for Ferrari one-off specials. I don't know, you know, we got other companies now also in the one-off category, following the Ferrari's footsteps, so to say. So, it might be a real exciting time for car enthusiasts, for car owners, for guys who just want to see, and gals who want to see the most insane, baddest cars on the planet. And with that said, I'd like to bring this video to a close. So, if you like the video, like the video. If you dislike it, dislike it. If you want to see what I got planned next, come see what I got planned next. I got a lot of stuff for this channel. I want you guys to be there with me. With that said, I'll catch you next time.